Welcome back to the Polman's Cooking Series. I'm Ali and I'm a busy mum and I really do feel guilty and to be honest, a bit annoyed when my family doesn't eat healthy. I like to plan ahead and so today we're going to be cooking two winter soups. A deliciously smooth and creamy pea, mint and potato soup and a Middle Eastern spiced vegetable soup. We will enjoy one soup today and the other I'll freeze for later in the week. Multitasking is the key to making two soups at once. So I've got all the vegetables here prepped and ready to go. Um, I've got some onions and some garlic and look at this range here. This is all from my Polman's garden, including cauliflower, chilli, sweet potato and Pontiac potatoes from Polman's Potato King range. I've also got some peas and some mint. So what I'm going to do is get the two pans nice and hot. I'm going to put some oil and some onions in each one and a crush of garlic and we'll let them cook up for a minute. Get two large deep dish saucepans on the heat and coat both with a splash of olive oil. Toss in the finely chopped brown onion, stirring occasionally until it has gone opaque and is beginning to caramelise. Now we will add two cloves of crushed garlic and cook stirring until we achieve a delicious aromatic smell of garlic and onion sizzling. For our second soup, we need to add some cauliflower, chilli, sweet potato, rosemary, French lentils, chicken stock and cumin. Okay, let's add the cauliflower, along with the chilli, sweet potato, some beautiful rosemary. Then I'll pop in the French lentils, a sprinkle of cumin powder, and I'm going to top it all off with a litre of chicken stock. Give it a stir. to our beautiful potato, pea and mint soup. Now we're going to leave that to simmer away until the potato is soft, probably about 25 minutes. Now back to our potato, mint and pea soup. It's cooled down slightly and it's time to mix it up so it's nice and creamy. You could use a food processor, but I'm going to use a stick blender today. want this all blended together. The potatoes are nice and soft and we'll mix it up so it's nice and creamy. Now to serve the soup, just ladle it into the soup bowl. Try to keep it tidy, it's not always easy. With regard to our Middle Eastern soup, it's already cooked and I'm just letting it cool down so I can put it into a Tupperware container, pop it in the freezer and we'll have it next week. But there you have it, two meals cooked at once, how easy was that? 